canvas was placed in this box like so. Hey paint friends, are you looking to host a paint and sip, create party favors, or sell pre-drawn canvases directly to consumers? Then you've come to the right place. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to package and ship your canvas. Let's get into the video. Hey, if you're new here, my name is Aisha and I am a paint and sip instructor and a paint party business coach. I recently purchased a pre-drawn canvas from a small business owner online and I wanted to go over what's included in the box. For my privacy as well as the shippers, I did block out the information, but I just want to go over what could possibly be in this box. I'm interested to see the details that this small business owner put into this package. So. I'm gonna go grab some scissors and we're gonna get right into opening up this package. All right, so I have my handy dandy scissors and I have this package. First thing I wanna say is that this business owner could have bought just a regular package, but they did take the extra step to buy a package with some wording. Um, this one says, thank you for your order. Um, it could say, you know, thank you for shopping with a small business owner. Um, if you would like, it costs a little bit more money, but you could put your logo on the package as well, get it customized to your business. But I do like that they did take the extra step to put a thank you on the actual package. So I'm gonna try to open this without messing up the canvas or without cutting into any detail that I deem necessary to, sh to show you. So that's the package. Um, I'll see if I can find this on Amazon somewhere, but it is nice. It's a nice package. What I had ordered was a Rugrats Chucky canvas. And I believe I ordered an eight by 10. So this is the box it comes in. Now this is just a plain box that the canvas is in. There's nothing on it. There's no stickers or anything. I would have put a sticker on the box. If it wasn't a custom box, um, I would have went the extra mile to actually put a sticker of some kind on it, a circle sticker, square, square sticker. Um, but I, I definitely would have put something that says, you know, my brand on here so that's definitely something to think about when creating your package for your canvas so let's see how we open this all right y'all so the first thing this is what it looks like well i don't want to share my my information but the first thing you see is a thank you so there's a thank you here and I don't want to put the business out there, but it's a little cute little index kind of card that says, thank you. It does have their social media handles on it. it says, thank you for choosing us. We hope that you love your artwork. Be sure to capture your creation and tag us and be featured on our social media pages. We can't wait to see your masterpiece. So that's cute. I like that. Then after that, there is a 8 by 10 PDF of what I ordered. So who was shipped to, who was billed, and what should be in the actual package. So you want to include that just to make sure you got your order right. And then there's a canvas. And this is so cute. And let me look at it real quick before I put it to the camera. So this is actually pre-drawn by hand. Little Chucky from the Rugrats, which was a great show. And I can kind of see the little pencil marks in it, but they did a great job at tracing over their pencil marks um, and putting this together. This is, this is really cute. This is really cute. And it is packaged. And behind it, we have 
some paints. And I do want to say that this small business owner definitely went the extra mile when it came to paint colors. They made sure that the colors matched up with Chucky. So these are all the, the colors of Chucky. I probably would have just put primary colors, but they, she, her, it, I'm going to go with they. But the small business owner definitely made sure that all the colors necessary to create Chucky, the original version of Chucky, was included in the kit. So all of these colors, this is his skin color. Um, I believe this is something that has to do with his shirt. And these are the colors that's in his shorts. I thought this was really cute. It comes with three different paint brushes. It comes with an apron. And then it comes with a, a paint palette. So what do you guys think about this? This is really, really, really nice put together. This is so cute. I can't wait to draw this. I really can't. But that's the back. That's the front. And that is all that's in the box. I'm not even sure if the box was necessary. You know, it's all about the details. So the box definitely adds to the detail, but could this not just be in the bag? Could it not just be shipped like this? I wanna know your thoughts. If you're really paying attention to the detail, as well as profit, cause you know, the whole Point of being a business owner is to make a profit how would you package this but I do think that they did a great job at packaging it um, I would have loved to see way more things related to the actual the actual business so their logo um, all of their handles there's at the business name but it doesn't tell me what platforms that that business is on um, but this is really cute and I can't wait to draw this. But that's all for this video. Um, I hope it was helpful. I will try to include any links that I think would help you in your business in the description box. And as always, happiness starts with paint. Mm -hmm.